welcome back thanks for clicking hope you guys are doing great so is the quran better than the bible so we're going to be checking out what the quran says about family and what the bible says about family so let's check it out so in the seattle airport looking for a place just to relax and meditate and read i looked over in the corner of the airport and i saw a black man who was a Muslim reading the Quran. I said, he's a good candidate for the gospel. So I walked over to this Muslim brother who was reading the Quran, and I just stood up over him. And after I stood there maybe 30 seconds, he must have felt the heat from my presence. <laughs> I was carrying my little black Bible. I took my little black Bible, and I laid it right on top of his Quran. And I said to the Muslim, my book is better than your book. That ain't true. That's not true. So get your facts straight. The Bible. In the book of Luke, chapter 14, verse 26, Jesus says, If anyone comes to me and does not hate his own father, and mother and wife and children and brothers and sisters yes and even his own life he cannot be my disciple Bir al-walidayn the goodness to the parents Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about honoring the parents in the Quran in parallel to his tawheed وَقَضَى رَبُّكَ أَلَّا تَعْبُدُوا إِلَّا إِيَّاهُ وَبِالْوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانًا Now, number one, the worship of Allah. وَبِالْوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانًا And that you be good to your parents. I was carrying my little black Bible. I took my little Quran and I laid it right on top of my little black Bible. And I said to the Muslim, Your book is better than my book. <laughs> In your book is better than my book. إما يبلغ عندك الكبر أحدهما أو كلاهما فلا تقل لهما أف فلا تقل لهما أف ولا تنهرهما وقل لهما قولا كريما. The Bible. Deuteronomy 21.18-21 through 21. If someone has a stubborn and rebellious son who does not obey his father and mother and will not listen to them when they discipline him, his father and mother shall take hold of him and bring him to the elders at the gate of his town. They shall say to the elders, This son of ours is stubborn and rebellious. He will not obey us. He is a glutton and a drunkard. Then all of the men of his town are to stone him to death. You must purge the evil from among you. All Israel will hear of it and be afraid. Zechariah 13.3 And if anyone still prophesies, their father and mother to whom they were born will say to them, You must die because you have told lies in the Lord's name. Then their own parents will stab the one who prophesies. And I said to the Muslim, Your book is better than my book. وقضى ربك ألا تعبدوا إلا إياه وبالوالدين إحسانا إما يبلغن عندك الكبر أحدهما أو كلاهما فلا تقل لهما أف Schrijvingen richting haar te sturen. En nadat je die klaar had, las je drie keer. Subhanallah, oksimu billah, nu ik jullie in bellen ben. Nu ik jullie waar over wie ik het heb. Oksimu billah, zij gaat voor voor iedereen. Mooi. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Amma. En daar was alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. دابك في الدرس امي وسبحان الله على بر الوالدين اقسم بالله لما حبست الدرس قلت له من دابا غادي نجاوب على امي سبحان الله صيفط صيفط قلت 
دعي معنا دعي معنا دعي معنا واسمح لنا اسمحي لنا راضي عليا امين امين الحمد لله ان شاء الله صافي انا بعد الدرس نتصل بك صافي امي واخا واخا بسلام يا نور سلام The beginning of the video, when the pastor said, My book is better than the Quran, I was like, What? What kind of proof do you have? Then they gave us a Bible chapter. Yes, there's, there's, a, there's, there's a chapter in the Bible which says, Honor your father and your mother so that your days may be long on earth. Yes, that one this that was displayed on the video is not wrong, but you should have also displayed that part of the chapter which says honor your father and your mother so that your days may be long. So you know the Bible also teaches us how to show love to to our parents, to our loved ones. Yeah, so yeah, so I'm I'm not saying that the Quran is wrong, no. The Quran to no 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 the Quran is not wrong. Like they read it in, in some of the chapters and I was moved by those chapters and it gave us instances instance instances in which the Quran speaks so well about the parents, about how children should, you know, take care of their parents. And this was really beautiful to watch guys. The last clip really touched me. This man was actually having a lecture in giving a message, you know, to his people. Then the mother called, he picked the call, and he started, you know, tearing up. I'm kind of confused what happened. All was he could tell his mom is, please forgive me. Only God knows what happened, because for him to cry, it's not a small thing. You no, know, for you to pick up the call of your loved one, of your parents, and you start shedding tears, there's more to it. Is that you, you're showing much, maybe you're missing your mom, you, you, the distance is making you miss her, or you did something wrong and you believe that if your mom forgives you, that's when your blessings can come. That is actually true. When you do wrong and you tell your parents to pray for you or your parents pray for you, your blessings will surely, surely come. And that was so beautiful. Like, I wonder if he was able to continue the message, the lecture, because uh, that was really emotional and you could see how um, he was really genuine about the love he, he was showing to the mother. That was genuine love from mother and son. Beautiful guys, and it's a wrap. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button for more. Like, share, comment. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.